Hello and welcome to quiz class. Today we have a 100 question quiz on old sayings. I hope you enjoy it. Many hands make light work. What do these words of wisdom mean? Working together makes a task easier. Many subordinates mean little work or try to pass the task on to someone else. Working together makes a task easier. What in time saves nine? Burn, rescue, or stitch? A stitch in time. Do not throw the baby out with the bath water is a way of expressing what? Don't remove what is good to remove what is bad. Be careful when treading on sensitive subjects or overworking yourself can lead to dire consequences. Don't remove what is good to remove what is bad. What idiom is used to express the state of loving someone more when they are not with us? Head over heels, absence makes the heart grow fonder or to be a million miles away. Absence makes the heart grow fonder. According to the words of wisdom, what do you never look in the mouth? A gift horse, a hungry lion, or your mother-in-law? A gift horse. What does the expression, people who live in glass houses shouldn't throw stones? People with faults should not criticize others. Vulnerable people should avoid initiating conflict or don't hurt yourself trying to protect yourself. People with faults should not criticize others. Early to bed and early to rise makes you what? Healthy, happy, and nice, healthy, wealthy, and wise, or live in paradise. Healthy, wealthy, and wise. What is any job worth doing? Worth keeping, worth appreciating, or worth doing it well? Worth doing it well. What is the meaning of the squeaky wheel gets the grease? tend to urgent matters first, attention is more likely given to one that complains or people with too many problems get ignored. Attention is more likely given to one that complains. How would one express the belief that an improved economy will benefit all people? All for one and one for all, united we stand, we, united we fall, or a rising tide lifts all boats. A rising tide lifts all boats. What does the phrase, you'll catch more flies with honey than with win vinegar mean? Flies are always attracted to fresh food. Watch the friends you keep by being sweet. Winning people over is easier when being polite. Winning people over is easier when being polite. What does make hay while the sun shines mean? Make the most of daylight savings, take advantage of a favorable situation while it's there, or do not procrastinate until it's too late. Take advantage of a favorable situation while it's there. What words of wisdom refer to the possibility of sacrifice to create or achieve something? Can't make an omelet without breaking a few eggs? Success is no accident or life is a song, sing it. Can't make an omelet without breaking a few eggs. Which of these phrases refers to the belief that a successful person is likely someone willing to take chances? Fortune favors the brave, Strike while the iron is hot, or every dog has its day. Fortune favors the brave. 
What does strike while the iron is hot mean? Make the most of an opportunity, wait until a situation is at its most favorable, or do something as soon as the opportunity arises. Do something as soon as the opportunity arises. What does the expression, we are burning daylight mean? Waiting the entire day before getting started, hesitating when matters should be tended to urgently, or time waits for no one. Hesitating when matters should be tended to urgently. How would you express the belief that someone that does not settle will never accumulate responsibilities at the cost of wealth or status? A rolling stone gathers no moss, one man's trash is another man's treasure, or you're a day late and a dollar short. A rolling stone gathers no moss. How would Granny express a difficult task done? It was like herding cats, it was like making a tree bark, or it was like swimming in winter. It was like herding cats. Finish the expression. Beggars can't be what? Winners, saviors, or choosers? Beggars can't be choosers. According to the expression, what of someone is another man's treasure? Stolen goods, trash, or bread? Trash. What is the rest of the phrase? You can lead a horse to water, but you can't drink it for the horse, and show it how to drink, but you can't make it drink. but you can't make it drink. How would Gran express her experience in a certain situation? I have eyes on the back of my head. This is not my first rodeo, or do you know me? Do you watch TV? This is not my first rodeo. How would you be told that you have the wrong idea, are misunderstood, or are wrong? You're barking up the wrong tree, you're a day late and a dollar short, or the early bird catches the worm. You're barking up the wrong tree. What is the meaning of the phrase a day late and a dollar short? You missed the opportunity, too little too late, or not worth it. Too little, too late. Why would you tell someone, don't put the cart before the horse? They're getting ahead of themselves, they are doing things in an unproven way, or they are doing things in the wrong order. They are doing things in the wrong order. How would you express the advice of not depending on someone that you are not certain will happen? Don't count your chickens before they've hatched. Do not come into agreement with fear or absolute certainty is the greatest of all illusions. Don't count your chickens before they've hatched. What is meant by a watched pot never boils? Waiting anxiously makes things feel longer. Someone watched too closely will not perform or tending to something too much can ruin it. Waiting anxiously makes things feel longer. Which of these is the correct way of saying the expression? Too many cooks spoil the gravy, too many cooks spoil the soup, or both are correct? Both are correct. Which of these phrases is used to refer to the danger of focusing all your resources and efforts in one area? Don't put all your eggs in one basket, don't take any wooden nickels, or don't buy a pig in a poke. 
Don't put all your eggs in one basket. What does don't take any wooden nickels mean? Do not down trade, do not sell anything for less than it is worth, or avoid being cheated or being naive. Avoid being cheated, cheated or being naive. To buy a pig in a poke is another way to express what? Buy something in a hurry, make an investment while in debt, or something bought without being inspected. Something bought without being inspected. Finish the expression. You can't make a silk purse out of a cow's ear from nothing but zippers or using wool. Out of a sow's ear. <clears throat> what phrase originating from a poem compares an intangible concept of joy with something beautiful? Diamonds are a girl's best friend. Something beautiful can provide lasting joy or a thing of beauty is a joy forever. A thing of beauty is a joy forever. What best describes the meaning of the expression pretty is as pretty does? Someone whose inner beauty reflects on the outside, someone beautiful might be ugly on the inside, or typical things pretty girls do like shopping. Someone beautiful might be ugly on the inside. A trouble shared is a trouble halved. What does it mean? Telling someone a problem makes it easier to deal with. If someone takes half of the blame, the blame is smaller, or four hands do twice the work of two. Telling someone a problem makes it easier to deal with. What is one piece of advice that grandparents often give about being positive? A silent mouth is a whole mouth. Hate the sin, but love the winner or find the good in everybody. Find the good in everybody. What is one practical advice that grandparents often give? Actions speak louder than words. A leopard never changes its stripes or blood is thicker than water. Actions speak louder than words. What is one piece of advice that grandparents often give about family? Blood is thicker than water. Friends are like family you choose or we are who we are. Blood is thicker than water. What is one piece of advice that grandparents often give about communication? We must make time to socialize. We must make time to talk or we must make time to listen. To listen. What is one piece of practical advice that grandparents often give? Pay yourself first, pay your debt first, or pay yourself a visit. Pay yourself first. What does the expression burn the midnight oil mean? Something that smells really good, work late into the night, or a romantic encounter? Work late into the night. What does the idiom put one's nose to the grindstone mean? Work without a goal, work hard and diligently or harshly criticizing the work of others. Work hard and diligently. What does the idiom sweat of one's brow mean? Avoiding hard work effort in hard work, or a great relief. Effort and hard work. What does it mean to wig chop? Cutting off someone's hair, shopping for a wig, or slapping someone on the head?
cutting off someone's hair. What does it mean to ask, what's your bag? What's your problem? What did you bring? Or what are you interested in? What are you interested in? What does it mean to razz my berries? To arouse someone, to be flirted with, or to annoy or tease someone? To annoy or tease someone. What are threads? Food, books, or clothes? clothes. What does it mean to be decked out? To be prepared or kitted out? To be dressed stylishly or completely lose your mind? To be dressed stylishly. What does the phrase blood, sweat and tears mean? Extreme effort and hard work, devotion, loyalty, and effort, or a very bad situation? Extreme effort and hard work. What does don't flip your wig mean? Don't cut or change your hair color. Don't get too excited or don't get angry. Don't get angry. What does it mean to clean up real fine? To clean up a mess, housekeeping, or to look very attractive? To look very attractive. What does it mean to be a cool cat? An arrogant person, a successful person, or a trendy or stylish person? A trendy or stylish person. What is a passion pit? A place to grow passion fruit, a drive-in movie theater, or a group of people romantically involved? A drive-in movie theater. What does it mean to be on cloud nine? Someone that passed away, to be extremely happy, or being spoiled? To be extremely happy. What is a brewski? A beer, a whiskey, or a coffee? A beer. What does it mean to be blitzed? To be beaten up? To be very fast? Or to be very drunk? To be very drunk. What does it mean to be cruising for a bruising? A pub crawling? Looking for trouble? or a Sunday driving, Sunday driving. Looking for trouble is the answer. What does it mean to be ticked off, to be angry or annoyed, to be done with a to do or to tell on someone? to be angry or annoyed. What does it mean to know the skinny, to know the latest fashion trends, to know the inside information, or to be on a diet?
to know the inside information. What does the phrase roll up one's sleeves mean? Prepare for hard work or getting started, getting ready for a fight, or to stop procrastinating. Preparing for hard work or getting started. What does the term wet sock mean? A stick in the mud, a mama's boy, or a limp handshake? A limp handshake. What does the term happy cabbage mean? A colorful salad, large sum of money spent on self-satisfaction, or a happy person? A large sum of money spent on self-satisfaction. What does the term pang wangle mean? To cook a delicious meal, to play a musical instrument, or go along cheerfully regardless of misfortunes. To go along cheerfully regardless of misfortunes. What did the term gas mean in the 1960s? A fun activity or one that inspired you to laugh, a type of fuel or giving someone grief. A fun activity or one that inspired you to laugh. What did it mean if a movie was a big tickle? The message behind it was mindful, it made you laugh, or it was a huge success. It made you laugh. What did it mean if you called someone a wet rag? Uh, no fun or a bore, someone old and not well taken care of, or a sad person. No fun or a bore. What does the phrase, come on, snake, let's rattle, mean? Asking a girl to dance, asking someone to go on an adventure, or inviting someone to play a game. Asking a girl to dance. What did it mean if someone asked you to the submarine races? They wanted to go swimming, they wanted to go to the drive-in, or they wanted to make out in the car. They wanted to make out in the car. What does the term in the ketchup mean? Operating at a deficit? the proof, or in trouble. Operating at a deficit. What does it mean to lay a patch? Mowing the lawn, getting a tattoo, or black marks caused by tires and burnouts? Black marks caused by tires and burnouts. What does it mean to be on fleek? Someone or something that's fun or fine, to be perfect or flawless, or to be on screen? To be perfect or flawless. What does it mean to clap back when a plan or scheme blows up in your face? to fight back or responding to criticism in a witty manner. To respond to criticism in a witty manner. What does the term flub the dub mean? To evade one's duty, to sing out of tune or to dance poorly. To evade one's duty. What does the term a pine overcoat mean? A type of winter coat, someone very introverted, or a coffin?
a coffin. Which witty expression refers to an unsophisticated but wealthy businessman that acts like a real Casanova when visiting a big city? A baby big boy, a butter and egg man, or a pleasant peasant? A butter and egg man. What does the term a rain napper mean? A person who takes a nap in the rain, an umbrella, or a type of raincoat? An umbrella. What phrase means to be quiet and stop talking? Gun or remote, shut the door, or put a sock in it? Put a sock in it. What did the phrase don't touch that dial mean? Don't pick up the phone, don't get near that person, or don't change the TV channel? Don't change the TV channel. What does the idiom, you sound like a broken record mean? Someone is playing a scratched vinyl record, someone singing out of tune, or someone repeating the same thing? Someone repeating the same thing, being repetitive. What does the phrase, the milkman's baby refer to? The idea that a lady had an affair, the baby has a very light complexion, or the milkman's assistant. The idea that a lady had an affair. What does the phrase waiting by the phone mean? Maternity, anxiously waiting for an important call, or waiting by an agreed phone booth. Anxiously waiting for an important call. What does the phrase, all that glitters is not gold, mean? Money can't buy happiness. Not all things that seem valuable are so, or beauty is in the eye of the beholder. Not all things that seem valuable are. What does the phrase, an ax to grind, mean? Working hard to achieve a goal preparing for a setback, or having an agenda or personal motive. Having an agenda or personal motive. What does the phrase bring home the bacon mean? To enjoy the labors of one's fruits or the fruits of one's labors, to take on a difficult task or challenge or to earn a living or provide for one's family to earn a living or provide for one's family. What does the phrase don't judge a book by its cover mean? To be cautious and skeptical of others, not to judge based solely on appearance or to appreciate the value of hard work. Not to judge based solely on appearance. What does the phrase drunk as a skunk mean? to be heavily intoxicated, to be extremely happy or excited, to, or to be in a state of confusion or disarray. To be heavily intoxicated. What does the phrase hold your horses mean? To be cautious of potential dangers, to be prepared for any situation, or to hold up or be patient. To hold up or be patient. What word is used to refer to one's outfit, particularly a stylish one? Groovy, rags, or threads? Threads. What is grandma's equivalent to the slang term fire? Whack? Groovy or smooth?
groovy. What does the phrase bite the bullet mean? To eat a bullet, to accept something difficult or unpleasant, or to bite someone? To accept something difficult or unpleasant. What does the term break the ice mean? Initiate conversation or break off an awkward situation. Time to start drinking or break up a fight by using water or ice. To initiate conversation or break off an awkward situation. What does the idiom butter someone up mean? To impress someone with flattery, a massage, or to spoil someone? To impress someone with flattery. When would you ask someone, cat got your tongue? Someone obsessed with cats? A person nervous around cats? Or one at a loss of words? One at a loss of words. What does the idiom turn a, bl a blind eye mean? To ignore situations, facts, or reality, to slowly lose one's ability to see, or to close one eye. To close one's eye. What does the idiom bury the hatchet mean? To bury a weapon connected to a crime, making peace, or moving on. Making peace. What does the idiom caught red-handed mean? Caught with evidence of a bad act, caught in the act of doing something, or to be found guilty? Caught in the act of doing something. What does the phrase give the cold shoulder mean? A massage with cooling agents, infect someone with a common cold, or being cold or unwelcoming towards someone. Being cold or unwelcoming. What does the term hot potato mean? A controversial issue nobody wants to discuss, a potato that is very hot to touch, or a lazy person that has a short temper. A controversial issue nobody wants to discuss. What does the phrase beef up mean? To feast, especially on red meat, gaining weight, usually muscle, or to strengthen or make something more effective. Strengthen or make something more effective. What does the idiom go bananas mean? Go wild, crazy, or extreme? extreme anger or jealousy, or acting like a fool. Go wild, crazy, or extreme. And bonus question, what is moo juice? Let us know the answer in the comments. Thanks for playing this quiz. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell and see you next time.